Welcome to Jack's Tech Corner. I'm your host Jack and this is a very short but very much needed uh, video tutorial on Microsoft Word 2010. Now I'm not really sure and I have to investigate if this is in uh, 2007 or not but I know it's in 2010 or 2010. Let's have a look at how we would create a custom tab on the top. Let's simply go to File, Options, and we're going to go right here to where it says Custom Ribbon, okay, or I call it Tabs, or it's a ribbon because it's the whole entire length of the top of the screen. Over here under Customize This Ribbon, it says Main Tabs. You can see where it says Home. We're going to add New Tab. Once you get to that new tab, we'll blow this up just a little bit here. We're going to right click on there and go to rename. And we'll rename this Jax. You can name it anything you want, obviously. Tools. Now, under Jax Tools in this first group here, we're just going to call this group. We're going to rename that and we're going to call it Items. Just like so. So now we have Jax Tools is a tab and we have Items. All right. Let's add things to that uh, that I use a lot. I use things like font, uh, font color. I use uh, save as quite a good bit, uh, quite a bit, and print preview and print. So we have those ones on there. Once you have those added from the left to the right, just simply click OK. And always remember, folks, you can move these up and down. If you want this uh, Save As to be on top, you could do that. You can move those around. Click OK. Now that we're back to our standard uh, standard interface here, you will see now at the top, we now have Home and Jack's Tools. And here you can see we have that Save As, Font, Font Color, and print preview and like I said you can add anything in here you want and you can also make different groups uh, I have items here maybe this would be called fonts uh, you know whatever but what this saves you uh, time in doing because we you know most of us don't use everything up here and you're clicking around you're trying to find it or uh, maybe you have to click here to do something and click here you know back here to do something now you just have everything right at your fingertips Hope you've enjoyed this quick little video tutorial, and if you have, please uh, stop by my website. It's jackstechcorner.com. I'll show it to you here real quick, just so uh, in case you're not familiar with it. Once again, it's jackstechcorner.com. Uh, check out my DVD collections there if you're a photo uh, photo or a photographer enthusiast. I have a lot of uh, Photoshop element tutorials. I also have um, stuff in here to use Dropbox, and there's some videos on YouTube on that. I do offer my book for sale, as well as you can donate to the show. So if this uh, video was helpful to you, please take the time and stop by my website, jackstechcorner.com. Check it out today. And uh, please subscribe to the shows. Thank you. And until next time, I'll see you back here very soon. Bye for now.